Hello. Hello. Same beer. Yeah. Same coffee. Right. Let's hope. I've been looking for these to do a review for a while since they come out. I couldn't oh, no. find them. That don't bode well then. And I found them, but I was looking for Jaffa Cake pineapple as well. well I'm not going to say anything because I don't know which order they're going up in. So, Doritos, Tangy Cheese. You can get them anywhere. Mm. You want to see it? Alright, Ed. Flame it up, Tangy Cheese. Now, I'm not going to slate it, because I know they're not going to be hot. I'm imagining flaming hot is going to be like the Monster Munch, which is like a flavour. Yeah. And no heat to it. It's just going to be like a chilli flavour with the cheese. No. So. It's hot. Oh, worn it. Ah, right. So, I might have to slate it now, seeing that. <laughs> I wasn't. I'm going to let them off, because I think they'll be like Monster Munch and just a chilli flavour, but no heat to it. But they've gone and done it, ain't they? Put warning, it's hot in the bottom corner. So, Doritos, you're now going to get slated if it's not because you're bragging saying how hot they are. You might be like them roulette ones. And I'm pretty sure a six month old baby ain't going to eat these, who's no. probably the only one that will say they're hot. Yeah, but Doritos chili ain't got that on, have they? No. And they're not hot. No. What? Hmm? Bring it in. Whoa, I'll tell you what, though. Smell up. No, look at the colouring mm. on them. Look at the colour of them. It could be the cheese. The cheese is awfully orange out of three. I think I washed my hands when I sneezed. Uh, oh, I hope right. so. <laughs> Loaded with flavour. I can only smell cheese though. Oh wow, look at that one. Some there. Mm. They are warm. I'm getting the chilli on that. Surprise. Oh, on that one. And the cheese. Now, I think these were a quid. The only place I come across them, and I worked in there for these, was B&M today. I went in for some jiffy bags. Uh, and I noticed these, I've been looking in supermarkets and can't find them. So I don't know if they're generally in the supermarkets or what. Mm, I like them. Now, the cheese is there and the chilli. They don't need the warning though. No, they're not red hot. But, but imagine if you've had yeah. a good whack of them, they will be. I'm not, <coughs> I went down the wrong goal. I'm not marking them down for that. <coughs> because you can taste the chilli. Mm. And probably the people that eat Doritos are not into red hot stuff anyway. Because Doritos chilli, they're not even mild. They're I think lower. they're my favourite Doritos. But, yeah. Didn't they bring a really hot one out? Yeah, a roulette one. I, I thought they brought one out on their own as well. No. Oh. Right then, nice in that case. Nice to pick the hot ones out yeah. of roulette ones. Forgetting the roulette, because I've never seen to get the hot ones in that. So, as a standalone flavour. Yeah. Uh, as a standalone flavour. I've been there first. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. And they, like you. They're my favourite, because now yeah. I've had a few, I'm getting the heat. Yeah. Well, the cheese is my favourite anyway in Doritos. So stick a bit of chilli in there and jobs are good. Mm. Yeah, no. Yeah. Not having any more. I'll sneak them later. <laughs> oh, hang on, man. I'm not sure. Just have to... Just have to have a whole packet. <laughs> no. Yeah, I'm getting the heat on my tongue. It's not red hot. Um, I mean, if you've had the Seabrooks Scorpion Crisp, you know as hot as that. Oh no. But, you can tell the chilli's there. So talking curry-wise, if you had korma and nothing else, I think they'd be too hot. Yeah. Because the chilli's there. Um, 
Chica. You'll be able to eat them, but you'll know it's there. And you'll be saying, oh, they are a bit spicy. Medium in a curry, you'll be fine. Yeah. But you'll still know the chilli's there. You can't have them. But they are nice. You are getting the cheese and you are getting the chilli. Yeah, definitely. You're tasting everything. And the warning, like you say, if, you, if you're a pig like me and you're going to eat, well, I ain't because I won't see them again, but if you bought a bag of them and you ate the old bag, you'd know you've had them because mm. the chilli's there. Mm. Very good. In fact, I didn't have two thumbs up. Oh, yeah. Because they're really nice. I didn't know I could do two. Yep, brilliant. Hmm. They're my new favourites. Are they really a limited nice. edition or are they just a new flavour? I don't know, but I think being a. I'll be going over there back end of the week. I might nip in and get a couple more bags just in case. Hmm. They're um, nice with that hot salsa you make. Because as I say, I've not seen them in the supermarkets. No. I don't know. I didn't look in Asda. I've looked in Tesco's and I looked in Morrison's. And now I've got them, so I don't know whether they're slowly getting them out of the supermarkets. But I think, unless the supermarkets are told by these companies we want them on sale now, I think what they do is they try to get rid of their other stock before they put a new one in. Yeah. Because Tesco's over here are flogging off the state ones still with the Christmas packet. Oh, yeah. So I bet they've had a shed load of them and they're not going to bring any new ones out until they get rid of the other stock. No. So I think that's what they do, whereas B&M, just get, if it's new, it's in. Uh, yeah, and bargains is a bit the same. B&M always crank everything out a quid or so, don't they? So Yeah, but it's like the same with that. We did the Kit Kat Green Matcha tea. We got that from B&M, was it? Or Ed Bargains, one of them. Mm. In about August last year, weren't it? Yeah, something like that. And I've only started seeing it in Tesco's in the Oriental section. It's chocolate. Yeah. In the Oriental section, green matcha, Kit Kats. And I've only been seeing it in there for about the last three or four weeks. Oh, so they have only just started stocking it. Be a while before they're in Tesco's then. And I guarantee you, I didn't look, but I bet you that's at least 50p, if not a quid more, for a four finger bar of Kit Kat mm. than it is in B&M. And they had it last August. Yeah. So these will catch up, but keep looking for them. If you can't get them in your supermarket, check your B&M, because they've got these, and I can tell I've had it. Oh, you no. I'm not, I'm trying to burp. Oh. Uh, they're nice. <laughs> We've got no dog biscuits left, we need to go soon. Right. So, double yep. on that one. Double whammy. A double with red thumbs. Orange thumbs. Go and get them. If you like spicy crisps, then again, judging it, I could sit with that and a beer watching football and I'd be happy. See you later. See you later. Oh, right. Nice.